This week in history, the American Civil War, 1863. In one of the war's key turning points, General George Meade wins a decisive victory over Confederate General Robert E. Lee's forces near Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. The bloody three-day engagement marks the last time Lee attempts to invade the North. One day later, after a 47-day siege, the Confederate bastion of Vicksburg surrenders to General Ulysses S. Grant's Union forces. This action, combined with the surrender of Port Hudson five days later, means that Union forces control the Mississippi River, which they will hold for the rest of the war. Grant was relentless at Vicksburg. It didn't work the first time he tried it, didn't work the second time, three times the charm. He just basically broke the Confederacy there. With the Union finally being able to control the Mississippi, they controlled all of the goods, all of the armaments that were going up and down the river, starving out the South. It was kind of the end of the war for the Confederacy. Be sure to like and subscribe and check out our new videos at HistoryNet.